traffic. So I was like, hey, let me check in on my YouTube Denture family, see how they are doing. I'm doing okay. I'm on my way in to work. And um, I have uh, been doing pretty good, guys. Um, I mean, you know, as far as uh, my, my, my smile and family, we doing okay. We making it. We keeping our head above the water. And um, the job, the new job is going good. It's very physical. So I am tired, and the good thing about it, it helps me keep my weight down. <laughs> Sorry, switching hands on you guys. And um, I know it's been a minute, and I don't, you know, uh, don't mean to fall off, but I do like to, you know, give y'all updates and on how I'm how I'm doing. Uh, I want to thank. Miss Sandra Philly slash Cha Cha for my gift, my denture fit. I am so excited about it and I haven't used it yet, but I am. <laughs> Trust and believe that. So thank you to Cha Cha and Denture Fit. I'm not sponsored by Denture Fit, so I don't want my comments disabled, you too. But, um, I'm still doing pretty good with my fit. My regimens is still the same pretty much. Um, right today, like I said, I, you know, going to work, I do like to be secure. So I have my fix it in powder on top. And I have the Polygrip Gold at the bottom. It's been doing pretty good. Now, a little trick that I've been doing to get the adhesive to stay is once I do my top, I put the glue on the bottom, I let it sit for a couple of minutes before I put it, I don't put it directly in my mouth. Gets it a little tacky and it stays down to, you know, up until time for me to leave. So when I'm crunching on my chips and everything, I'm not getting any food particles under that bottom denture. So that's why I'm so anxious and excited about trying the denture fit so that I can see what it does. Now I know denture fit is made for the top denture, but we've been doing it on the bottom. And I'm gonna try it on the bottom. And I might put just a thin, 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 thin layer, thin, thin layer on the top just because I want to feel that cushion. <laughs> but yeah I just wanted to reach out to you guys I miss you I really do I think me and Miss Vicky may do a live Saturday don't quote me you know you you know guys how my day gets and how we get busy but you know when I do I'll announce it and she'll announce it on her channel as well. It's so good to see you guys. I do get a little chance to watch the videos. I may not comment, but I will like and support you. Um, thank you. I have some new subscribers. Thank you so much. I'm glad that I said something to get you to hit that like and make a comment and subscribe button button it's real important to me that I am helping so I really appreciate it um, again nothing has changed up in my regimen I'm gonna tell you something that I did stop doing and I was brushing my dentures twice a day and I stopped doing that what I've been doing is I brush them tremendously at night because that's when all the particles, the smoke, the coffee, and all of that on that buildup. But once I put them in my denture bath, and I put a, a half a tab tablet of the smokers and a half and a whole tablet of the polydent whitening overnight, they come out pretty clean because I feel them. Make sure ain't no coating or nothing on pearlies. You know, we can't be having no coatings. I've been doing that probably about the last few weeks 
If I notice a change or a difference in the color, then I'll go back to my two times a day. Um, still doing my mouth twice a day, though. Still doing my squirt of peroxide and brushing, you know. I feel like my top has shrunk and pushed back. So I almost feel like I have, especially when I don't have my, my you know, my pearlies in, I feel like I got a, a underbite. <laughs> but for the most part, I am comfortable. No mouth sores, no no slip ups of them slipping out. I'm doing great. And that's why I do these videos because I want people to know that's coming into it that you're going to be fine. And each day is, is going to bring on something different. That's why I call it my denture journey. A lot of people call it their journey because it is. You know, journeys, you know, have ups and downs, but there is a light at the end of the tunnel. Stay informed. Stay informed. Do your research. Hear what other people have to say that help them to get through. I'm not going to talk you guys to death. I just wanted to update you with a video because I hadn't done that. And we will go live and we're going to talk about whatever it is we want to talk about because that's what we do. I hope and pray that you all have a thankful Thursday. It's me, sweet lady V, and I'm out. Peace.